Hey guys, we're back! Welcome back to- I didn't realize this do- this ga this music was dope as hell. <laughs> like, listen to this, this is pretty- this is some pretty good music. This like gives me ba- this like gives me Battle Revolution or like Diamond and Pearl vibes, I don't know why. Oh, you mean BDSM? I'm sorry, BDSP? Oh, oh, I thought we should talk about that. We really do, because... Have you, did you not hear? Oh, you probably wouldn't have heard. <laughs> so... A certain, uh, vocabulary of the avian variety? What the hell are you talking about? <laughs> no, Brian, don't! <laughs> <laughs> oh my gosh, there's been like a... This, so, a new Family Guy meme has been circulating a bit, and it's like... It's, so, you know the... Yeah, oh wow, a song named after a girl, totally original. Name twenty, and then he, he does the thing. <laughs> yeah, there's been there's been a lot of those recently where it's like uh, indie indie games are better than AAA games, anyways. Oh yeah, name twenty. Terraria and Ter Terraria Eater Genesis Dominions Five AI War Fleet Command Faster Than Light Factorio Rim World Binding of Isaac Might and Magic Three Kenshi Doom Ultima Three Off World Trading Company Darkest Dungeon Thea the Awakening Salt and Sanctuary Unearthed Waters Temco's Deception Master Mods Titus Ogre. Name twelve more. They'll have to be three. Hey. Nethak, Crawl, Adam, Alana, Angband, Iggy, Transcendence, Battle for Westnoth, Dwarf Fortress, Cave Story, Splunky, Prismata. Name six more. They can't have to. And they have to be. They each have to be different genres of action game. Hollow Knight, Mount, Mountain Blade, Crosscode, Dota 2, Path of Exile, Warframe. Go fuck yourself. <laughs> <laughs> oh, did it finally bite the dust? <laughs> Oh. <laughs> Joey, I, I think you need a new phone case. <laughs> <laughs> you don't say. <laughs> so you had oh god, on, what uh... is that? <laughs> oh. Okay. It's Anakin's Force Ghost, that's what it is. I, I think you said like An Anakin's Foreskin. <laughs> oh, now Mike hates Spielberg. Oh, but yeah. So, yesterday, they put- oh, no, not like this. Not enemy status. No! 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 Oh, Eric just no! showed me real quick. No! <laughs> Fine, I won't. No! Uh, Eric just showed me the, the new Pokemon Snap, uh, and, uh, and I was like, man, if only the new Pokemon game looked like this. <laughs> Yeah, I was saying the same thing about that in Monster Hunter Monster Hunter Stories 2. But we'll get into that. I keep wanting to say Rise, but that's not the same game. That one also looks very good, but Monster Hunter Stories 2 is much more applicable to Pokemon because they're both are they're both monster collection RPGs. So yeah, the um So on Wednesday, they they released a new Pokemon Presents. Oh no, not like this. Yeah, so they put out a new Pokemon Presents, which is essentially the Nintendo Direct for Pokemon. Yeah. Because Pokemon's that big that it gets its own Nintendo Direct. And, uh... So we got some deets, some anniversaries. Do you know Pokemon Go is five years old? What? Yeah. That kind of physically hurts me. <laughs> I, I, don't, I don't know how to respond to that. Yeah. And then, um... What, 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 why are we so old? <laughs> Alright, I'm on it. <laughs> but yeah, so then, they gave, they gave some, uh, they gave some news about the upcoming Pokemon games, that being Pokemon, uh, po uh as he said, BDSP, and Legends Arceus. And, Arceus, um... Arceus? Arceus? RCI? Arcus. <laughs> <laughs> True... True fans will know that. Not of me, of uh, MNJTV, but regardless. Anyways, so irregardless. Indeed, my grandma still says that. I know. She's... I have I have permanently damaged my grandmother, and I'm she not said sure. Said it the other day, and I was trying so hard not to. <laughs> Bless you. Thank you. Bless you so. Kirk was in Seoul. <laughs> oh, but yeah. So the um. <laughs> They put out more information on the Diamond and Pearl remakes and Legends Arceus, and oh my gosh, they uh, I don't know what they did, or like, how, I, yeah, I, don't, I just don't know what they did. 
but the <laughs> games look actually pretty good. Oh, really? I don't know what they did. To, but with Arceus, I can get more into that. But with BDSP, I I legitimately... I need to see like a side-by-side -side of the first trailer versus this new trailer. But, like, oh my gosh. It, the, I mean, okay, so the features they show off in the trailer are not revolutionary. These were all features that were in the original Diamond and Pearl, like the underground, secret bases, uh, Team Galactic, etc. But for like, some... I'm still a little bummed about the chibi art style. Yeah. But for some reason, it looks a little better now? Maybe it's the way they move? Something about the way that, like, Brendan had, like, a bobblehead. Not Brendan. What's his name? Lucas. Some For some reason, Lucas had, like, a bobblehead when he was walking around. And just the way he moved looked weird in the first trip. But now they look they look actually pretty good. Hmm. And I think they actually improved the lighting a bit. And the textures. I think. I would need to see a side-by-side. -side. The pattern of the pants? Like, seriously, though. And then... Oh, cool thing they added in. We actually get character customization this time. Oh. Yeah. So that's awesome. They didn't. They act, so people were really pissed off when they didn't have that in Omega Ruby Alpha Sapphire because they had it in X and Y, but then they took it out because they're going like, oh, well, they didn't have character customization in the remake. It's like, okay, they, or in the original, like, okay, they didn't have Mega Evolution either. <laughs> <laughs> Which, still no word on Megas. Game Freak's been real silent in that <laughs> since that came out. Oh my gosh, did you see- have you seen the infamous... Oras review? Mm -mm. There I think it was on IGN. Either IGN or Nintendo, I think it was IGN. But... So... On there, so it's, it's, a, it's a scale of like, it's a scale of... Like, 1 to 10 with a decimal point there. Yeah. And... The, uh, so 8, 8.0 and higher is usually what's considered, like, you know, good game territory. Like a passing grade. Yeah. They give it a 7.8. Hmm. And th a f some of the, like, they, they had three main criticisms that were there. I'm like, okay. So the, the two of them were actually, you know, they were like, okay, these are, these are reasonable criticisms. The last one was too much water. <laughs> Which... It didn't have a dog. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> Critics loved it. No, fuck you. <laughs> but yeah, and the... Uh, yeah, that's been a meme in the Pokemon fandom for a while where it's like... Anything gets like low score, like, oh yeah, 7.9 out of 10, too much water. <laughs> you know, now I'm just thinking, all the people who complained about Oras when it came out... Imagine what they think of the new game. Who? Who complained about Oras? Well, I don't. Just like the, I don't know anyone with that. The, the that select few. No, I don't. Th th I don't. That are probably now like, oh my god, it's so much worse. <laughs> 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 like it could possibly get any worse than this. <laughs> Famous last words. No, like no. I I've I heard like the bitching about Pokemon started when it honestly started Gen Gen Five. Seven. No, oh. Gen Seven. Like, it was... Okay, so the seeds were sown in Gen 5 of, like, what, what what could be happening. Like, you know, the whole... The gym was only having three Pokemon. The, the rivals always coming out, coming like, you know, there's too many rivals, etc. And... The, um... But then, Gen 6 kind of started... Gen 6 was, like, one that was a bit iffy. Because, like, people liked it and people didn't like it. But Gen 7 was the one that really kicked off people getting mad at Pokemon. Because we did... So, we we got Ultra Sun and Ultra Moon one year... Sh like, a day shy of a year past Sun and Moon. Yeah. Which, that's not good. <laughs> Well, in, was that the one that started a whole controversy of like, oh, they're using the same sprites as the old one? No, that's that's Sword and Shield. Oh, gotcha. Yeah, Sword and Shield. They were cutting the re so like we wouldn't care. We didn't care they were using the same models. We cared that they were cutting Pokemon and had a bad excuse for why. 
Huh. And then, uh... Oh, and that was also the one where they're like, you can't transfer Pokemon anymore, Yeah, that's right? the one. Yeah, you can't do that anymore. Which is stupid. But, uh... Yeah. And then, yeah, like, yeah, Ultra Sun and Ultra Moon were honestly the ones that kind of kicked things off with that. With, like, people hating on Pokemon. Because, like, after that, it was just kind of like... People just mad at Pokemon for a while. Yeah. That's kind of... Kind of lame. <laughs> Because they were doing some pretty lame things, like, you know, re-releasing the exact same game a year later, and then instead of a brand new Pokemon game on Switch, we get, we get, um, we get Let's Go Pikachu and Eevee, which I like those games. Those are good games. Also, can we just talk about the fact that <coughs> we kind of called the Alolan region? Oh, yeah, we did. We made a, we, we were going to make a, <coughs> <coughs> we were going to make a, we were going to make a, we were gonna make our own Pokemon region, and then we were gonna make it. Ba we were gonna base it off of Hawaii, and we we're gonna call it the Helios region. And then they made one based off of Hawaii. Granted, it was called Alola. Heck, he <coughs> isn't Helios have to do with the sun too? Oh yeah, Helios is like the god of the sun. Huh? Yeah, isn't so that also called Pokemon Sun? <laughs> well, Pokemon Sun <laughs> takes place in Alola, so oh, it all that's, checks that's out. <laughs> That's right. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, so that's right. <laughs> Joshua. Joshua. <laughs> Aren't you uh, forgetting something? We're not doing this thing again. No, no, We're we, not we've, do we've done not it like this. <laughs> <laughs> Anyways, so um uh, But I swear to god, you say it I'm gonna slap you. <laughs> But yeah, so then. <laughs> ah! Ah! Call the police! I am the police. What? Shut your mouth! I'll ah! shut it for you. Bap. <laughs> but yeah, so. Oh right. But yeah, and that, for some somehow. The game just looks really good now, and I I can't really quantify why. I just think it looks so much. I'm like getting actually hyped for it. Oh no! <laughs> it's spreading. <laughs> <laughs> no, no. I mean, I'm I'm still wary. You know, I'm just like you know, I'm not I'm not just I'm still like disappointed that the, that's the way it is. But I'm like like if you look at it by itself without that, I'm like okay, this is. I'll give this a fair shot. Well, I mean, that's more than most would give it. Yeah, so honestly. That, 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 good, good on you. Mm hmm. But yeah, and, um. And then Legends Arceus. <laughs> oh my gosh, it looks so cool. Because it's made by Game Freaks. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, oh my, like, you can. You, you, don't, you don't have to, like, throw your Pokemon out to fight Pokemon. Well, okay, you can't fight back, but Pokemon just straight come after you. Huh. Yeah. And there's an organization that's, like, exploring the region. And the symbol looks kind of like the galactic symbol. And their leader kind of looks like Cyrus. <laughs> and their... And, I mean, and their name is the Galaxy Expedition Team, so... That would be the point. Oh, we're talking about the Arceus game. Yeah. Oh, I was like, oh, no. well, yeah, Eric, if they're making a remake of Sinnoh... No, they just nicked Team Galactic <laughs> for no good reason. <laughs> they just remade the game twice. <laughs> but yeah, I am... And the Pokemon models don't move at, like, five frames per second. <laughs> I mean, that's a plus. That Chingling moved in, like, slow motion. <laughs> like, it was crazy. But yeah, then, we also get new regional variants. Hmm. Uh, Stantler gets a new evolution, as does Basculin. Which looks... The fish? <laughs> yeah, and it looks badass. Badass Basculin. I know, it's weird. Who'd have thunk Basculin could look badass? But yeah, then, also we got a new Braviary. Oh. Yeah, which is, it's a, it has psychic powers. And then we've also got a new Growlithe. <laughs> Hit him with your Arcanine, Ash. <laughs> Arcanine, fire, fire blast. What? <laughs> that is clearly a Growlithe. That is clearly, uh, Officer Jenny, you should know this. You should <laughs> know best. Officer, arrest that man right there. <laughs> <laughs> Police, help. Police, help. Police.